they wanted a manager who could uh, control the clubhouse, who would work with the front office, be open to uh, analytics. And I think that probably with Dave Roberts, they have the full package there, and they have a guy that I think the players will respect and like. I'm Matt Wehmeyer with the MLB.com FastCast. After overcoming the odds to carve out a 10-year playing career, Dave Roberts has now taken a similar path to land a coveted managerial position. On Monday, the Los Angeles Dodgers named the 43-year-old the 28th manager in franchise history, who spent this past season as a bench coach for the Padres. Roberts played for the Dodgers between 2002 and 2004, but his most famous act as a player occurred in the 04 postseason as a member of the Red Sox. He stole second base in the ninth inning of game four of the ALCS and scored the game-tying run moments later, sparking the Red Sox remarkable run to their first world championship in 86 years. Seen as a long shot candidate to land the job initially, MLB.com Dodgers reporter Ken Gurnick explains how the cancer survivor won over the team's front office. He was a grinder. He uh, had to get the most out of his ability to even make it to the major league. He turned himself into a pretty good major league player through hard work. And I think that players respect that. He's a very upbeat person. And I think that was clearly something that, that management was looking for because they want to bring a more energetic attitude to the clubhouse and just try to get the most out of these players. So that's what they've chosen in Dave Roberts. In other managerial news, former Pirates and Mariner skipper Lloyd McClendon has landed back in the dugout. The 56-year-old has been hired by the Detroit Tigers to pilot their AAA affiliate in Toledo. McClendon is no stranger to the Tigers organization, serving as the Major League bullpen coach in 2006 before transitioning to hitting coach for the next seven seasons. He was then hired by Seattle for the managerial position in 2014, but was dismissed after a disappointing 76-win campaign this past season. You know, the game of baseball doesn't know anybody anything. Uh, this game has been tremendous to me, and I've tried to give it everything that I've had. And it's blessed me in a lot of ways. You know, you move on, you learn to move on, and, and you're grateful for the opportunity. The Mariners continue to have an active offseason as they finalized a one-year deal on Monday with veteran catcher Chris Iannetta. General Manager Jerry DePoto has already stated that the 32-year-old will enter spring training as the primary catcher. But DePoto also spent part of his Monday by refuting a report which claims that star second baseman Robinson Cano is unhappy in Seattle. Though the 33-year-old did express frustration about his early season struggles, DePoto was quick to shoot down any lingering speculation about Cano's discontent. Shortly after the season end, I ended, I sat down with Robinson in my office for two hours and made a great talk. I think we left on with a very clear understanding. And as we're moving forward, we believe he's, he's going to have a, a strong season as our second date. For more on these stories and the very latest hot stove activity, keep it locked in to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.